Assalamu alaikum and welcome to Jan Sewing Solutions. Now I'm going to be go, coming to Leicester today for the annual women's conference. But So I've just got ready and I thought whilst I'm sort of, I'm hardly ever dressed these days. So I will give you a glimpse of my suit that um, I had made just a little while ago. Uh, okay, so this is the suit. It's a... Uh, mix and match combination is a navy color suit which has been sort of contrasted off with a similar color lace finished off with a similar color lace um, and the lace has been inserted in i've used a fabric which is a bleachy uh, fabric velvety type of uh, nylon based uh, bleachy and uh, that's what i've made of the sleeves and also i trimmed that off on the hem so this is uh, what i was talking about that this is a uh, quite a tailored look effect it's got um a sort of a glatty gala with it now the other thing that i've made with this is i've made a navy color abaya and then i've made a combination of jackets so i am in a bit of a rush i'm going to give you a quick glimpse because i know i hardly ever get a chance to actually sort of get ready and do these videos anymore so here goes so the next thing that i made with this was uh, this princess coat abaya um i actually cut it in here and i did think i cut it long and then i realized it came out just a marginally a uh, sort of an inch shorter than what i would have wanted it in a way it's better because when you're wearing flat heels or when you're not wearing anything in your feet it doesn't actually uh you don't trip over it <laughs> so always be careful in the length but um i don't know this uh, fabric it does tend to stretch back up rather than have a fall anyway so the fabric is lycra i used three and a half meters and again it's a princess coat it's a very wide coat but i made this obviously to go with the jacket now this is the jacket so here it goes so this is a, like a mix and match combination and I know I haven't given, I showed this on the table but I didn't actually try it on and show you. So that's, there we are, that's what the jacket looks like. Uh, it's a bit sad that I'm in a little bit limited space and I can't sort of give you a full full view of it. Also, you need something like a second camera person <laughs> to actually give a full look. Uh, I haven't got anybody else here, so unfortunately. Now, the only thing I managed to miss out on this was putting a hook on. So I'm going to quickly put a hook on and then head off. Uh, now, if you're not at the annual conference this year, then I ho do hope that you make it for next year. This is the second year that I've been going. And these uh, these, these an annual conference uh, have been taking place for the last 18 years, if I'm correct. Anyway, uh, it's a wonderful, wonderful uh, place to be. It's a absolutely uh, experience that you can't imagine i suppose the only way i could imagine i could uh, sort of associate it is like you're almost almost in the harem sharif it's the closest to harem sharif that we can get is to leicester so inshallah i'm gonna be may allah accept my hibada may allah all give you all tawfiq to join us there perhaps next year mm, the video is gonna get uploaded a little bit late so uh, you know, it's a little bit difficult to believe. I mean, uh, for us, it's like a, quite a distance. We're traveling uh, almost like, um, I don't know how many miles. It's two and a half hours journey. But uh, there are people who are close by and who miss opportunities like this. And that's so sad. Anyway, hope to see you. Hope to um, hear from you. Hope to have lots of chats with you again very, very soon. I hope you uh, go on and uh, follow the tutorial for making this and also the tutorials for making a lot of the others uh, that I do regular tutorials on.